It's okay. I do this every time. I always I always forget it because it's a step I have I have to physically go there because YouTube will not accept. Just won't accept me. YouTube just will not accept our love. There we go. So yeah, now we should be up now. If you're wondering who you what what happened on YouTube, don't worry. You didn't miss anything. We just I forgot to set it up to stream out there. So hey, welcome. Hello. Just, let's see. Yeah, as I said before, uh, we were left off in, we were inside of a village of dinosaurs that were all, well, not yeah. just dinosaurs, also mammals too, and a couple of others. And it's like, yeah, no, they they were all like kind of brainwashed a little bit. And, yeah, uh, they were like living in an underground city, like under a mountain, right? To yeah. protect themselves from the predators. Yeah, And pretty there's much. mushrooms and fungus everywhere, so maybe they've been eating too many mushrooms. Then but we got they mugs. don't want to leave, even though... They need to leave for like supplies and resources and yeah, you know, living. They need something to do stuff and things, but also just keep in mind, like we also got mugged. So we did. We got we yeah. We did get all of our we, money. We stolen. did. We didn't do anything. We were just minding our own freaking business, and then all of a sudden, somebody takes our money. I don't know why, but that is the funniest thing. Oh dear, baby face Mike. <laughs> yeah. Welcome. <laughs> Must have been a while since you've seen me. I've been shaved for a bit. Yeah, he's bit. been shaved for a couple of weeks. Yeah. Like... There we go. I mean, losing the facial hair makes most people look younger. It's very rare to see it's someone who looks same older thing when I get a haircut. People don't recognize me or anything because the hair totally changes a person's uh, look when you've not like paid a lot of attention. Mm-hmm. But yeah, we yeah. The, well, the other game we saved was a little bit further ahead. Oh yeah, you're right. Hold on. Uh. No, you nope. hit the, the right button. That, that one. Mm -hmm. hey, hey, there we go. Do, 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 do. There it yeah. is. Yeah. There yeah, we it was. All right. Oh, I'm glad you know what you'll be watching tomorrow. Meanwhile, Dave. in the Hollow Earth. Yes, exactly. <gasps> Who are you? I want to talk to you. Ah, it's you again. Ziv wasn't... Welcome. Do you need anything in particular? Zneef. Uh, not really. Just wanted to have some small talk. Ah, so be it then. I'm always looking for a good conversation. Long have you been a resident of Fungilia? Is that long have you lived here? In a mountain of mushrooms. Oh, let me tell you, I've been here for a um, oh, quite a long time. I remember the previous, previous chief, Fungil... Fungil... Oh, dear me, my time sure is flying. As he puts the flying. bottle back underneath his feathers. <laughs> oh. Well, I could definitely tell. If you're living in such a safe environment, you just don't pay that much attention to the flow of time. Let me tell you, I still remember how Charles was just a tiny little hatchling, and she was really tiny. Uh, okay, I, I, I get the point. No need to skip down memory lane. Uh, has a situation like this occurred in the past? So since you've been living here for so long, has has anything similar like this happened before? You mean the thief situation and the closure of the village? Nah, I don't recall anything like it happening before. Well, let me tell you, it's been very peaceful here since the previous chief of the village sealed up the undercave. We only had two evacuations in the past, but... Fortunately, both of them turned out to be false alarms. Evacuations? Yes, child. Fungil is a rather elaborate evacuation plan to ensure the safety of the villagers in case of any... You know, predator would be dumb enough to attack our settlement. Fortunately, the evacuation has been going or been used in a very long time now. And let me tell you, I'd like it to stay that way. Uh-huh, so 
What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, you know, just I'm sharing my white mushrooms grow big and strong. Being a retired dinosaur, I have all the time in the world to tend my garden. It's wholesome. Garden, huh? Others usually just grow some fancy colorful plants in their gardens. Your choice is quite unusual. Indeed, but I suffer from hay fever. I just can't stand flowers, you know? Oh. These for decoration or some other purpose? Decoratives win, unless there's a purpose I don't know about. Neat. And, uh, do, do these really require all that attention? You said yourself that they're just for looks? Oh, they definitely do. Maybe not as much as some of the other finer mushrooms, like the Scarlet Glow Shrooms, but still. Scarlet Glow Shrooms? Indeed, the one and only. Let me tell you, they're very hard to cultivate. Fungula is the only place in all of Polysemia that grows them. And since they have a variety of uses, especially in medicine, they are our top international trading good. Man, this villa sure loves its mushrooms, huh? Anyway, uh, can I have one of these white mushrooms? Oh, I'm sorry, Znivu. <laughs> these are precious to me. Each one of them reminds me of days gone by. Ah, that kind of precious, I see. That should be going. Uh, we'll take care of Mr. Nor North Ronicus, I'm going to say, until we look. Yes, yes, the youth definitely has a tight schedule nowadays, right? Goodbye, Znim. Neef, it, yeah, I sure do. <laughs> you old coot. Yeah, there's a very much... I, I, I agree with that, Seth. Yeah, no, uh, I'm fine. I have recovered fine. I'll be okay. We're not going to... Trust me, we're not working on anything other than the house. This Do is not pick quite too much. I'll, I'll be okay. <laughs> Do not worry. He is a big... He, he, he is a big lad. He's going to take care of himself. Oh, every time you join, I've been wearing the VTuber model. Well, I mean... <laughs> All you have to do is say you want it. It's only a button away. It is. And you get the cursed crow. It's on you. But can we handle the cursed crow? I don't. See I don't think some. I think some right people now. just straight but up wait. can't. There is a relatively large crack in the dome, letting the sunlight and some fresh air inside. Several shiny stones are also reflecting the sunlight to even the remote parts of the dome. Hmm. That would explain why all the plants manage to grow and bear fruit in such environments. They have a system of mirrors. Okay. Smart. Well. Ooh. Oh, the sun. I don't even know what's over here. I just wanted to see what was over here. I think it's worth it. Yeah. Look at these mushroom designs. Mushroom crossing. Oh my gosh. Tax collector. <sighs> Wait, we're back here at the... Oh. Yeah, I think we've been here before. Yeah, yeah, because look at the little mammals. Oh, hey, Yogg's like, forever, blah, blah, blah. You know the drill. No, 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 Yogg. Yeah. Thank you for the courtesy. But Mike, Duncan Fisher. <laughs> Duncan but Mike, Fisher. Dunking effing Fisher. To what? I don't know. I don't know. That's all it says. But Mike Duncan Epic Fisher. What's the context here? I don't know. Honestly, I think it's fun. You're out of context. Yeah. All right. I need to check something real quick when we get back here. I must know how we say this this dinosaur's name. I don't. Yeah, I was going to say, I don't think you had to come back here to do it, but yeah. Well, no, we were just coming back this way anyways. Yeah. No, it's not you. Thescalosaurus. Hmm. See, where is the old... Where is the old coot? Or is he... 
a type of dinosaur we already met before. No, he's just one of these. Okay. Nothronicus. Yeah. Nothronicus. Okay. You got it. Gotcha. 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 Yeah, dinosaur you it. names. I nailed it. For I can totally speak Latin. As if you couldn't tell. All right, we need money to get this shiny rock. Mm. And we have Hello. a mushroom, a heavy rock, and a magazine. But so far, nobody was going to buy the comic book from me. Right. Well, mm -hmm. I often, I, I actually wonder what the Zaro Force would do in this situation. Agreed. Can we read it? Click and hold. Yeah, I, I think it's the bottom one. The Zaro Force and the mind controlling meteorite. Do I turn pages? How? No, it's just showing us. It's number Aww. 26. Oh, I was hoping we could turn the page. Hello, people. Hello. Mm, squid. Maximum greetings, Turbo Dinosaur citizens. How goes the events? We well, are... so far, the events are going. We are going. You know how it is, trying to figure out how things are working. And also, hello, blue gentleman. And red pirate kiwi. And don't forget, he's just keeping an eye out for any thieves. Yeah. Doing such a great job. Such a good job that I totally did get all my money stolen. Okay, so... can. A closed wooden door. You can hear some noises coming from the inside. Maybe look through the, the crack in the door. Why don't you talk to it? Well, I, that was looking at it. So I'm going to talk to the noises. Not oh, talk. Yeah. And what happened to knocking? Knocking. You knock on the door. I did. Oh. A single eye. Do you have the pass? Uh... I didn't think so. Nothing happens. Okay, so we need a pass. This place does seem a little shady. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> like. Yeah. It is a little bit shady. Cat, move over. You're, you're moving the iPad. Thank you. Still doing work things, but this makes it for a stylist look at vibes while unbreaking another user laptop. I wish you luck on that. Yeah. Users tend to break laptops quite an awful lot. Oh, yeah. What's this a, is where we got our money stolen. Yeah, it's that, it's that dark alleyway. Yeah. Look at these mammals drawing stuff on the walls. How inconsiderate. Can't stand it. Are you it. sure it's the mammals that did that? No, no self-respecting dino would ever draw on public property. I highly doubt that. Um, that was the way I came. I am a silly. Although I wanted to point out there is something right there in front of you. Wait, was it? Devo Menace. Thanks for the courtesy. What? Yeah. Are you not seeing that? Yeah. Look at. Okay, there you go. That's just a. Uh, right. Walking to place. Okay. So. How do, how do you think you I, get up? That that's an area you need to get up to. Look at that. It's got an X on it. It's got like a pot. How do we get up there? Something to think about. That's a heavy rock. We don't have a pot. But we need a pod to put up there or something. Yeah. How do we get one? Probably with money. It's true. Hmm. hmm. Okay, so we need to figure it out. Yeah, we need to figure it out. We need to figure all the things out. That's the wall alley. Yeah. Which I think just kind of loops us back around. That's true. <laughs> we are, although there, I noticed there's a mortar and pestle just sitting right there. Foreground. No, it must be just a part of the scene. Yeah, it's just decoration. Oh, look, and that guy is really sad because we spoiled oh, the end of the book. Oh, he's so sad. Let's talk to him. <laughs> Don't talk to me or my friends ever again. <laughs> oh, my gosh. De Stegosaurus, that is... That is amazing. <laughs> yeah, just... Zniff just came in and was just like, Hey, I'm just going to... Uh, Spoil this old comic book for you. Yeah. 
can't he's go like, down. He's can't like, mess with this he's stuff. like, please do not put the obvious thing that you'll need to put into my. Oh, the obvious thing. No, I have to. Wait. You, you no, can only, I can you only, can only eat that. Yeah, you need to. You need to act. I probably need the what's, white mushroom. What's on that uh, picture? Oh, if I remember right, it's a wanted poster for the totally accurate poster of the thief. Yeah. Okay. Totally accurate poster of the thief. Bad guy. Got it. Thief. Bad guy. We're looking for something that has angry eyes and screams. Yeah, even in the dino world, no one likes spoilers. Break bottom door with something. Ah, oh, we don't have a thing to break. Um, I mean, we have a heavy door, but we don't there's have also a, a guy in front of it. We we don't have Wait. a thing to do that with. It's not a it's not a door we can break open. They yeah. want a pass, not a break there's in a entry. There's a person in there. Yeah. And this guy's guarding this door. Yeah. Looking for. Imagine a money salesman. Instead of you doing stuff, you give people this piece of paper as an IOU for uh, IOY for goods and more paper. Let's see. Maybe I can sell the rock to these guys. This guy up here. I don't know. You could probably sell the rock up there. Maybe. Maybe. Or if not to him. I don't think any the... of this will work, but we'll. I think ah. there at this. I don't have any better suggestions. Hey, rock. Use <laughs> rock. <laughs> no, <laughs> I don't want to use it on. <laughs> but that, that's the only way I can pick it up. <laughs> Sorry, I don't do refunds. A rock? I wasn't... Okay, never mind. I guess he's not selling anything yet. Still. Hmm. I mean, straight up uh, dino jacked based on the amount of stuff I've seen go through the backpack. You should start picking up the other dinos and taking them with you. Involuntary tax <gasps> service. Correct. My God, that'd be amazing. You're like, well, my bag holds one grid square, which can be anything. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, here we go. I don't think we've been over here. And it looks like there's a roll-up ladder at the top. It does. I played a lot of Resident Evil. <laughs> they easy. love their drop ladders for some reason. Area is an excess. Oh, there you go. You praise yourself. So for yeah, for the marvelous. Yeah, too bad it didn't do anything. No. Oh, hey, pots. I cannot pick these up. Yeah. First like. Little door thingy. Is Mike and Mordor? Is his <gasps> room glowing? It's glowing. Oh, oh look at that. Just saying. Guy, he's just jamming. Al okay, Alberto. Al Alberto. Albertonicus. Albertonicus. Albertonicus, I think. Al Albertonicus. Let's talk to him because look at him. He's just jamming. Ah, yes, I feel good again. What a great day. Nothing could go wrong. Uh, yeah, nice, but what are you so happy about? Oh, uh, I was down with a really nasty cold, but our village uh, healer gave me some herbal medicine, and I feel much better already. Oh, I mean, good for you, man. Hey, wait a second. Since I'm not sick anymore, I have to go to work now. He's going to get bummed. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's encyclopedia updated. Warning: If you get sick, do not do not go back in. Oh man! Yep. Let's we could actually talk to him now. Our healer's cold medicine is truly something, huh? Okay, I guess we need to go see a healer about cold medicine. But you're cool. I need to know if I'm right. Yeah, oh. yeah. You killed the mood. <laughs> have we tried we war crimes yet? Not yet. The mood. Uh, no, we have not done that. This little guy, look at his stubby little yeah. arm! Oh! Alberto Nikas. Alber Alberto Nikas. Ah, Alberto Nikas. Okay, cool. Alberto Nikas. He's an insectivore. Look at him. He's yeah. so cute. Okay, Alberto Nikas, I guess you gotta go back to work. I'm gonna go this way. Sorry I killed your mood by reminding you inadvertently that you have work to do now. Yeah, Alberto's just vibing. And yeah, we just like took that away. Ah. How to goes there? Uh, what the, the. Hey, easy, Mr. Home Security System. I mean no harm. Ah. 
Alright, sorry. I thought you were that spoony thief who's been lurking around lately. Jeez, that looks painful. What happened to you, dude? <sighs> My wing got badly hurt. I couldn't stay airborne and had to crash land here. Yeah, I can tell that doesn't look very pretty. What happened anyway? I thought, uh... Navajo Dactylus... I hope, I think I said that. Navajo Dactylus are too good pilots to crash like that. Who or what did that to you? I don't know. I was just passing through the airspace, no problem, when suddenly a giant creature just swooshed in and rammed into me, scarring my wing pretty badly. I must have blacked out as I woke up, already tucked in here, with my wounds treated and my wing patched up. Sounds painful. So, uh, is this your place? No, I'm just resting over here and watching the house when she's not around. She... Oh, I guess he means the homeowner. But say, my butt's killing me from laying on that cold, hard shelf. Can I help me a bit? Elaborate? Bring me something nice and soft to sit on. Gonna reward you with something nifty in return. Hmm. Nice and soft, alright. I'll see what I can do. So are you a resident of the village? Why are you here and not in your house? Honestly, no, I'm not. F I live in Little uh, Terronia. It's. I didn't even know Fungilla was inside that mountain. I guess I was extra lucky to have crashed here and not somewhere else. Who knows how I'd end up? Extra lucky, huh? Heard that one before. Well, all right. Though you're familiar with the place. No, uh, not really. I was just flying by, visiting these parts. And I admit, the shape of this mountain piqued my interest, but now I know it was a bad idea to fly anywhere near it. <laughs> Ouch. So, you mentioned the house owner. Uh, who is she? Oh, her? She's a bit the uh, village healer, as they call her. A bit eccentric, but otherwise a sweet lady. Treated my wounds with extra care. Not to mention she and her friend are making all sorts of potions and mixtures. Uh, she and her friends? Uh, all right. Yeah, from what I understood, her friend's working somewhere near here. Okay, sounds interesting. Do you know when she's going to be back home? Sorry, no idea. She said she uh, how to find her skull. Wait, what, her... Her skull? A decorative skull. Stolen by that thief. She used to hang it over the cauldron. Of all the valuable tree gets stashed around here, someone just had to steal a useless decorative skull? Man, even these are hitting a new low these days. Well, I'll be taking my leave now. Stay healthy and take care. Yeah, same to you. Bye now. Well, that Navajo... Navajo... Uh, lock this seems pretty chill. You're not going to look at anything else in there? You're just like, well, I'm not allowed okay. in here. <laughs> You're like, no, I no, have to no, leave. We, no, no, we are going to loot the place. <laughs> First, we have to go back out so you can be like, oh, how do you say his name again so I don't get it wrong? Yeah, listen, man. Where? Wait. Yeah, because, okay. Pterosaurs are not dinosaurs. Navajo Lactus. Navajo Doctylus. Navajo Doctylus. Yeah. Yeah, Navajo fingers. they're carnivores. Look at him! Doesn't he look a little twitchy? Mm-hmm. Alright, but yeah. Uh, pterosaurs aren't actually dinosaurs. They're just... Uh, yes, elaborate! <laughs> yeah, that good dino molly. Look at the cauldron. Whatever it is, it sure smells tasty. Yeah, we're gonna hear chanting one of us. Yeah, maybe. One of us. One of us. Watch out, it's piping hot. It may leave you with a nasty burn. Well, you wouldn't want that now, would we? It doesn't look like there's anything else in here. Except for this guy. Oh, that mortar and pestle on the table. Uh, uh oh. Gee, isn't that tiny mortar and pestle just plain adorable? It is! Look how tiny it is! I did not 
mean to do that, but apparently I did a thing. A pun with crush, and it would be way too easy here. And I take it. The homeowner isn't here, so you'd probably not mess around with anything. Ah, uh, fair point. Yeah. I'm no common thief. That's the weird ostrich guy. Yes. The healer. The local healer. Believe me, we all know a local healer in our community. They know where to get the good stuff. <laughs> wow, okay. wow, look at this. Oh, oh, it's another Albertacus. It's really tiny. Oh, look at them. It's so They're busy. Orodromius, look at they're busy. I want to talk to him. Hey, I want to talk to you. You're looks busy, like but I want to talk to you. They're sorting, it looks like. Hello? Yes, yes, what is it? Are you here to pick up today's mushroom shipment, are you? Uh, no, i just like to... Oh, uh, then, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I just have no time to chat. Oh, no, definitely no time to chat. Oh, jeez, what's wrong with you, man? Why are you aiming to become employee of the month or what? Really? I'm in charge of sorting the mushrooms today. I need you to hurry up before the evening, yes, yes? The evening. I need to work fast, quick! Well, you seem very... Passionate about your work, but there's so many of them. Do you need any? Help? No, no, I can make it. Yes, I can thank you, but I'm in charge of it today, you see. Okay, right. Have fun, my friend. Yes, thank you. Now back to work. Back to work quickly. All work and no play. You. Oh, look at him. Yes, hello. Do you need anything? Ah, say, you're that newcomer Tra told us about. If you're looking for a job, then you've come to the right place. You look pale. Are you okay? You look kind of pale. Yay! Huh? Oh, uh, yeah, I'm fine. I just haven't slept very well lately. And since I'm working, since uh, I'm working since early this morning already, I'm very tired. Oh, is it because of the thief? No, not really, I think. Uh, it's just that there's been a lot of noise in the upper floor of the uh, building I live in, even at night. This kind of ruckus keeps waking me up. Huh, I don't know. Did you just try talking to your neighbors? Yes. They seem to have some special assignments from the chief himself and have to work during the night. <sighs> Man, bummer. Well, tell me about that job. Most of our tasks involve watering and taking care of the fields, the usual farm stuff, although sometimes you might get some kind of special assignment to spice things up. You'd have to speak with Tra to know what's on the calendar for today. For example, me and my buddy were assigned to some sort of the, uh, to assort these mushrooms out today. All right, since I'm out of options, I might have to give it a shot. Sure thing. Well, we definitely won't mind an extra pair of hands to work around here. What are you doing? So, you're just throwing mushrooms. That's uh, kind of boring, to be honest. Well, it's definitely not the most exciting thing I've done in my life, that's for sure. But I guess somebody has to go through the mushroom pile. At least my buddy keeps company. Otherwise, it would be a total bore fest. Hold on. You need to sort these huge containers alone? Yeah. The large amount of might look intimidating at first, but you can go through them fairly quickly. But still, I hope I won't land a job like that. It gets old really quick. Believe me. You sure you don't need any help? Ah, no, I wouldn't really mind, but my buddy over there won't let anyone else near those mushrooms. This is my responsibility. Today's mushroom shipment depends on me. Me! You see? Well, he's at least passionate about the job, I guess. Well, I can't deny that. Well, at least we'll be able to sort these containers in no time. Love to stay, but I guess I shouldn't bother you anymore. Gotta get going. All right, see you around. Well, hey, Cookie Mama. Hello. Keep my cat from playing with a fan's pair, the comfy cat. Yes, the comfiest of cats. Comfy, comfy cat. Oh, wait. Can I look at these mushrooms? Berry fields. Berries. Berries. Berries, 
berries, berries, mushrooms, and berries. Vermilion. Ooh. Berry. Look at it. You're pretty sure you've read about this mushroom before. Sadly, you can't remember the details. Can I'll look at that rock in a second. Can I take it? No, no, it must be picked properly. You don't want to touch such greasy mushroom with your bare hands only. So we're going to need... Okay, that's just a movement. We're going to need, like, gloves or something. Yeah. Hey, there's some more dinosaurs over here. Boxes and helpers. You don't want to disturb their work. Oh, I didn't mind disturbing their work back there, so what's the difference? Yeah, but they're, like, way off in the distance. They're obviously they're not... Right th they're right there, yeah, though, Yeah, but they didn't, Mike, they didn't give them could... the details. It's how you know. <sighs> but I could totally talk to them. Yeah, I know. It's fine. Berries, mushrooms, mushrooms. For the greater good. The greater good. Oh, it's in North Aronicus. No. Not the Aronicus. And a sleeping one. Let's talk. Sup, busy boy. Ah, stupid thread. Come on now. Jeez. Man, I feel you. That is hard to do without a thread. Sometimes without a thread, uh, a threader. Why is she trying to? Th Why is she trying to thread a needle with such a thick thread? It's just painful to watch. Uh, okay. Yeah. She, what she says. You might have to like give her a hand. It pains you to see that thick thread and narrow uh, eye struggle, but you refrain from any comments. All right, so nothing here. Sleepy boy. having a nap. Maybe I should leave him alone for now. How many more times are you planning to waste here? Oh, oh, wow, how much more time are you planning what? to waste? Damn. Oh. Dang, man. That's cold. What about Fine, the... We'll go upstairs. What about that hmm? pile he's sleeping next to? Ooh, ooh. True. Wait. Soft and very fluffy. It's perfect companion for any sleeping creature. Well, there we go. I thought it was like money or something. Upon closer inspection, you notice a small tag on the pillow. <gasps> What's the tag say? Free sample. Free sample. Well, here we go. Yoink. Yeah, it might come <laughs> in handy somewhere. I know who needs this pillow. Since it features a free sample tag, the owner wouldn't mind that much. Easy. Now, <laughs> 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 for example, take it. You acquired a pillow. Ah, uh, we could go give it to the Navajo Delicus. Does it exist? Yes, it implies the existence of a textile industry. For dinosaurs, yes. If so, what does the pre pre uh, prevalence of leaf-based storage say about the relative cost and or quality level of dino cloth? That's a good question. We'll find out. That's a very good question. I'm not entirely certain on the uh, entire <laughs> economy of polysemia, but I'm fairly certain it has something to do with textiles and berries. All I know is these guys use shells for money, and he's that one's yelling at me. Hey! <gasps> And where do you think you're going, huh? The room upstairs is private, mind you. Okay. What about back there? Um. Well, there's like a whole bunch of stuff on the wall. I know, I can't. I tried. Ah, all right. We'll have to go upstairs later. We got a pillow to give to the Navajo uh, yeah. Delicus. Step, 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 step. Step, oh wait, step. I think I can hold like Wait. Yeah, double click for speed. Yes. <laughs> so <laughs> fast. Zoom zoom, baby. Oh, she's back. Whoa, she looks cool.
There you go. Ah, yeah, pillow. Oh, man. And it's so comfy, too. Mmm, this is excellent. Since you're so kind, I'd like you to have this for your trouble. What's that? A slab of clay? Pantry. Yeah, you pantry pat. Yeah, pantry pass. I almost called you a pantry sass. <laughs> With that, you'll be able to get to the pantry and munch on some of the goodies. I'm still grounded here, as you can see, so I bet you'll put that in a much better use than I ever would. Hey, thanks a ton. Oh, no thank you for you, the pillow. Ooh. <gasps> we got a pass! We could go to the shady guy at the door! I bet. But first we gotta talk to... Okay. King Nagathus? King Nagathus. King Nagathus. Yeah. King Nagathus. Yeah, well... Sure. I assume. King Nagathus. Let's talk to you. Well, 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 isn't that our dashing heroine who survived the cold waters of Riven Na, navigated through the ordeal known as the Under Cave, and ended up in a remote village under a hollow mountain? <laughs> You've really made a name for yourself in the village already. You know that, youngster? Yeah, I know. I, well, I wish I kind of didn't. <laughs> this place you got here. It's a nice little workshop. Uh... Professional, yet really crazy. Cozy. Cozy. I read <laughs> crazy. Both work. Oh, you think so? Thanks. As a village healer, I need to have everything organized in a rather snazzy fashion. And since I like to do some alchemy and herbalism in my spare time, I'd, drawn a, <laughs> I'd drown in a sea of different herbs and weird thingamajigs without some proper organization. Oh. So you're kind of dinosaur who could turn potentially useless herb into a miracle cure. <laughs> it's... if that's the extent of my knowledge, then yeah. Just give me a shout when you need anything. And, uh, a common cold. Would that be a problem? Not even a sweat. But I'd need some herbs, and I'm currently out of all of my cold remedies. Hey, uh, being a healer, so I assume you're the one that treated the little fellow's wounds. You got that right, youngster. I found the poor thing while taking a hike uh, to a nearby forest not that long ago. Got me wondering what happened since there were no pterosaurs in the vicinity of the village for some time now. See. But at least all well that ends well, right? For him, maybe. For me, not really. While I was out fully focused on treating his wounds, somebody had broken into my house and stole my precious family heirloom. Oh, no. You know your thing. Uh, many different things, in fact. You biz for long? Oh, long? Ha! <laughs> Ever since I was a little hatchling, I studied my father's late work, or my late father's work, who was a brilliant alchemist. You could say I owe most of my skills to him. Oh, so it's a family business, right? Well, kind of. If you mean the healing skills, then no, my father was just an alchemist. I learned most of the medical stuff from the books or by taking courses from the previous village healer. Besides, there's still much I need to learn, especially in the uh, brewing field. I believe the pharmacy owner has such a had, has a much superior skill than I do. Wait, there's a pharmacy here? Yeah, there is, but for security reasons, you can only enter it with a special pass lately. My friends just has too much valuable merch inside to risk losing any of it, you know. No worries, I understand, but, uh, where's the pharmacy located? Ah, right. I keep forgetting you're a newbie. Uh, it's in the Cold Shade Street, just before the plaza. Care to say something more about the theft? Ah, <sighs> there isn't much I can add. My precious decorative skull. Oh, when I get my hands on that stinking thief, He's going to regret the day he hatched, that's for sure. Uh, I just wish the chief and our security team would put a little more effort toward the investigation. Have you tried speaking to them about it? And uh, why we're on the subject of... Nah, the guards blindly follow chief's orders. The man himself rarely gets out of his apartment lately, which is located on the topmost floor of the residential hall. And that really helps since the entire district is under a security lockdown can't enter the building anymore if you're not a resident of the district. 
I was about to ask that. Yeah, I already heard about the residential wall stuff from the guard. Ah, so you know how it is. Yeah, I totally forgot about today's gathering, so double bummer for me, I guess. All right, well, I suppose I should be running along now. Yeah, you should, youngster. Your chores aren't going to do themselves. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> She's yeah. a cool lady dinosaur. Yeah. I like her design a lot, too. Oh, no, the design's fantastic. Let's see. Okay, Cretaceous. I mean, look at that. Yeah. The feathers look poofy, crazy lady here. I love it. Zignathus. Okay, so Zignathus. 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 There we go. Today on All learning right. how to speak ancient Latin dinosaur crazy. names with Mecca and Mike, we have Crazy Healer Lady. All right. So we have that pass yeah. to go to the pantry. I believe that's our next, that's what we need to do next is go to the pantry. Wow, thanks, Recaposaurus. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, Recaposaurus. Alchemist. Yes, that's what we're going to call it. <laughs> so that place I'm not allowed to go and is full of all kinds of valuable things that I shouldn't have and need a pass that you need to own to get to where exactly is it? And could you detail their defenses in incredible depth? <laughs> incredible death. We should definitely save. Oh, we should. You're right. I'm going to get here and then I will save. And we're going to save here. There we go. We are saved. Safe. Knock on the door. Do you have the pass? I guess I have to get it out first. Nothing happens. I think you just have to use it on the door. Ah, there it is. Yeah, you're not going to be holding the item in the other hand. Let me in. I need noms. There's no response after this. I think it's for the pantry. But where's the pantry? It's the one that I believe the giant's librarian security guard triceratops is oh guarding. oh yes. yeah, yeah yeah that one that one hello you're right Mo cookie mama it's reader's theater with mecca mike and a cast of dinos was he those cold shade street or something hold on Tax collector. oh red octo bear oh Just i need sub. to go thanks the for the thanks okay. for the courtesy i heard that courtesy flush thank you that's awesome. Oh, it's uh, Super Chief. Thanks for the courtesy. Oh. Thank you, thank you. Look at the good Dogosaurus. No, th those, that's not a Dogosaurus, unfortunately. That's a very, very much anxious looking for Thievosaurus. Yeah, it this one. Yeah, that's the one. Oh, this was the like, angry. Yeah, you know, yeah, he's not full triceratops. This is some uh, another. He's um. Yeah. Unis. Yeah. It's Unesco a... ceratops. Yeah. Hey. Take this. Yo, look at my shiny new pantry pass. Can I go in now? <laughs> The pass is valid. Her face. <laughs> you may enter the pantry. Young Miss. <laughs> Thanks, UNESCO Ceratops. UNESCO Ceratops. I. All right. Whatever. Can, can you step aside already? The guard takes the pass, mumbles some more, but eventually nods, letting you enter the pantry. He just a, yeah, he's yeah, UNESCO Ceratops. I'm pretty sure that's how you say it. I can't remember. <gasps> yeah. Look at him. He's got quills. And look at this. It's a little... It's a lot for like this. Talk to mm. me, bud. Decisions, decisions. 
Uh, something wrong? Well, in a matter of fact, yes, yes, indeed. I just need simply don't know what to do anymore. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, slow down. What happened? I can't decide what dish I should cook for my girlfriend today. She's extra busy with work. Oh, that's wholesome. So I thought I'd do something nice for her. Hmm. I wish that was just my biggest problem. <laughs> what should I do? Hmm? Oh What's a God. hip and trendy <laughs> meal nowadays? Because I personally would just love to try some of these worms. Just look at them. Oh, man. Ugh, worms? That is disgusting. If you stumble upon a brilliant meal idea, just be sure to give it a sh give me a shout. You hear? Sure thing, dude. Just please don't mention mention these things ever again. Ugh. Kiwi, you're right. The dino guarding the pantry is doing his best Shatner impersonation. That Triceratops is totally fucking chill. This is oh, he's just like he seems way too occupied with eating to even notice you. Num num num. Yeah, this is what we call grazing in the mm -hmm. grocery business. Quite literally. It looks so grumpy. So. Anesco Ceratops, what's wrong? You're so sassy looking. Oh god, he's. Huh? What do you want? I mean, food supply is over there, you know. So why are you here all alone? Why are you sitting in this dark room? All by yourself. In the dark. Yeah, I was assigned to pantry guard duty today, and I just wish I didn't. It's as one It's one of the most boring things I'll ever, I was ever told to do. Looks like most of the folks around here have a boring job. I mean, most people have a boring job here. And protecting the entire pantry all by yourself. Well, the interiors at least. My buddy checks the passes at the entrance, and from what I've heard, he's doing a pretty fine job so far. So, yeah, I just wish those tough times would end already, as I want to return to writing. So, guard duty. Is your name Tonbert by any chance? Huh? No, why? Just curious. Tough times. It's because of the thief, right? Yeah. Uh, the security is tight pretty much everywhere. Apparently the thief has not only steal some valuables, but several fold rations as well. Hence the drastic measures like those pantry passes and whatnot. Speaking of, can I get a food ration? Oh, come on now. Don't make it harder for me. Can't you just take whatever you fancy from the pantry yourself? Meals on the house tonight, huh? So let me get this straight. You just sit here, do pretty much nothing to get paid. Sounds like the best job ever. Do you know how boring it is to sit here for the entire day when there's actually nothing much happening? Do you know how many productive things I could have done in that time? Not even my beloved books helped that much. The library was closed as well, and I can't get any new literature to read. Do you know how cool that is? Yeah, not cool at all. There, there. Maybe your friend has something new to read. <gasps> My friends have the same problem. Ever since the librarian was shifted to guard the entrance of the residential wall, being totally out of ideas, I started actually reading uh, those Zaro Force comics. And as mindless as they may seem, they're actually quite entertaining. Better than reading old books in the nth time, that's for sure. I see. And I really... Wait, mindless. <laughs> well, I should be going. Yeah, sure. Bye. Uh, be sure to come oh. back when you're hungry or something. Well, I have a comic book for you. Also... I, I like how his new, his uh, Nif was just like... Oh, yeah, I was like, oh, yeah, you just, you, you like Zoro Forest, we like Zoro Forest. Yeah, can, uh, can one of the mods, is anybody active? I know, there? yeah. That's... Okay, okay. Sorry, I'm just seeing it on uh, Restream, so I'm like, I can't. No, you're fine, it. just be, you'll be okay, just play the game. <laughs> I just, just, you got just, it, just, just play the game. You're fine, job, just, do, my... just do to play the game. I played the game, I gave him a comic book. <laughs> Hey, okay. is that a... 
Yep, the uh, newest issue of Zaru Force. Oh my! Uh, absolutely nobody told me there's a new issue. May I look at it, pretty please? Sure, suit yourself. Just be sure to return it later. I will. Thanks a whole bunch. You cannot blame Mike for bots. It's okay. Hi, Ad, but fully humans today? Probably not. Let's be honest. Indeed. Did it fool you? Are you a human? Dino guarding the it. pantry is doing his best Shatner impression. Look, really? buddy, I'm not pl pacing for security. It's just that I've had to take a leak for six hours. Now my shift ain't up. Yes. I love this Triceratops here. He's just, he's just so happy. <laughs> he's so happy to be here. I know, just num, 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 num. Okay, so the Triceratops at the residential wall, which is the big blue guy, is the librarian. Well, ask yourself this. Why did you give that person a book? Because he was bored. And what did you get out of it? Absolutely nothing. Yeah. But he's going to give it back to did, me later. Did you try taking anything? I'm only saying this because I know you go into areas and then you, nope. you don't click on the stuff and then we come back. Well, it's... No, no, there's a lot to go on. I, I've just, if we're excited to play. Yeah. And you'll be like, oh yeah, cool, new area. And then you'll just click the next area. And I'm like, wait, come back. We have to look at stuff. No. Video game. Plus it's not letting, it's not I'm letting good at solving me. puzzle games, but I have to look at everything in the screen. It's like an OCD for me. And I can't take anything from back here. That's what I thought. Yeah, let's take the metal hook. Metal hook. I, I didn't even see the metal hook. I thought it was just part of the floor, actually. Honestly, yeah. Hey, about that hook? Uh, yeah, 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 sure does. Don't bother me right now. <laughs> well, he technically said yes, so... Yoink! Hey, metal hook. Hey, we got a hook. Once we got a hook. What do we want to do with a hook? Hmm. Yeah. So it doesn't look like we can actually take any of the food right yes, now. Yes, we're totally human here. It sure is great to consume things and break <laughs> it down with acidic juices. Beep boop, just humans. Totally human. <laughs> okay, you guys are great. <laughs> yes, mushrooms in a basket, but I have a mushroom in a bag. Let's see. Okay. Uh, look at those drawings on the wall to the left. I don't know if we can actually... Can we to look the at them? Yeah, I'm just saying, look at them. Look like little stick figure dinosaur. I bet these guys did. Yeah, that's what I was look saying. It's such a great little detail. So cute. Look at you guys. I tried and they just said stuff before, but look at them. They're so precious. Uh, so, Abe, how about playing Unhatched next time, huh? You do that. I, I don't know how to play that one. Dude, really? Man, you're so behind when it comes to board games. General kid chatter. <laughs> I like how I, I like how the their movement then the triceratops is just like meh. He's just like no, 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 no. here, just meh. Eh. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> so cute. They're so precious. Dino babies. You could combine the hook with the grappling with a rope. Maybe if we had rope, it's actually a good we point. We do not have rope. But we might be able to get some. We might. That's a good point as well. Okay, plaza. So, there's a pharmacy. I think is it that? That's where the pharmacy is, but there's nobody. There's nobody there. Uh, well, we, there's there. We just need to. Mm. We also need to come up with a way to make money. Yeah. Let's but go back to, to the. To... Let's go back to the grandma's house and go inside because I don't think we've ever been inside their house. Grandpa's house? Yeah. If it lets us in. I don't think it lets us in last time. Let's see. Oh, I don't know. I can't remember. I'm just going off what's this in my... This is the wrong way. Sorry. Yeah, how Big dare you get lost in this town that we've only been to twice? How dare I? Yeah. How dare, how dare. Hmm. Yeah, if we can so find we some rope, we could probably use... If we could probably make a grappling hook. That would be cool. Grappling hook would be so cool. Grappling hook dinosaur. Yeah. No, I just like how when Zniff walks, it's just like, like step, 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 step. <laughs> very, very, uh, 
intentional. Nope. Can't go inside. And that just says... Yeah, I don't think we ever read the warning sign. I think it just said, like, don't pick the mushrooms. Oh, don't pick you white mushrooms. You pick white mushrooms. Ah, good call. But there are there are some growing across the way. Can I talk to you again? Will you tell me anything new? Hey, again? No. How fair things. Znof. You just call me Znof? Znof. Sniff. And, hey. Uh, that's all the same. Okay. Yeah. I'll be going. Take care, Mr. Northrop. Uh. Mr. N. Northrop. And this, because. Yes, yes. <laughs> well, you literally have a tight schedule nowadays, right? Goodbye. Sniff. Sniffin'? Yeah, sure we do. Zen. The nif oh, wait. So there's some red ones there. And there's some white ones growing across the road. I know. I can't. No, okay. An option. I'm just looking up things on the ground. Like, we could oh, pick I it know. up. Look, I'm a... Look. I just Not see I, I just see things that pop out, and I want to get them. I want to pick them up. Just want to touch them and hold them in your hands. Hell yeah. Okay, so we know this leads up to the pillow people. So... The the pillow people is that what we're well, calling the, guy, the people that are making well, the pillow past on. the farm. No, no, that is the wrong. No, no, you're that's the yeah. other side of the map. This is a totally. Are this you is sure? yes. This is where the cave is. Oh wait, wait, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, what? I too. My know brain if, today. I don't know, man. Know my, my brain today, man. I know my polysemia map pretty well. Yes, you. That's did. why we're you lost. Then, if not, Mister Turning. Turing, then scream incoherently with words to random classic class bowling guitar. <laughs> well, back on live, that confused one? That confused me. <laughs> it's a large mushroom. Can I take the large mushroom? I'm unsure how to take such a large mushroom. Oh. Okay, and then we have the... Ooh, wait. Ma no, I can only eat those. Never mind. I was about to say, I could probably give the mushroom to these little guys, but I can't. <laughs> Unified standard. Dino language. Okay. Um, maybe there's a thing over there? There's a thing over here. What's over here? Oh, because I dropped a thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I pick it back up? Okay, I got my unlit torch back. You never know. That might be useful. Actually, yeah. We might need that. Uh, oh, can you pet the mammals? I don't think pet I can. Pet our great, pet great, 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 great thousand great ancestors. But what if he bites me? We Yeah, they don't bite. They're fine. Yes, mammals do wait, wait, not. What did that say? Wait, what did that say? Hold on. Yeah, you click past the. You'll think of you'll need to think of a better way if you want that little mammal this badly. So we need to get. We need this little mammal, obviously. I don't well, I don't think unfortunately, none of this is going to work. We're gonna need to find some food for it. Mm-hmm. Which we have to get. Wait, a what's that read? What's that sign say? I know we probably saw it in the beginning, but I don't recall. The main gate is closed until further than noticed. Okay. Yep. Up here, I think. Yeah. Looks I like found, <laughs> parentheses, object, object, parentheses, to be the best part of this stream. Oh, we'd never seen this before. I think it's a gate. Two stone pillars are seated near the wall of the cave. They've most likely been here for quite some time. Both of them feature some kind of hole in the middle. Let's take a look. There's some kind of hole in the pillar with a bluish spot above it. There's some kind of hole with the, on the pillar with a reddish spot above it. And then there's a dino on top of that one. I feel like we'll probably need those glowing mushrooms because there's a red one and a blue Ooh, one. Oh, can you get it? Can I put them? Let me see. Oh, maybe we can throw some of that rock pile to knock it down. 
The rock pile or pile of rocks, if you prefer, uh, there is a mushroom growing on top of it out of your reach. I think, yeah, let's try throwing it a rock at it. That's my solution. That's probably why the dinosaurs don't wouldn't like me. Nope, that won't help you with the, both the rock pile or the mushroom. I think we do need to get a rope of some kind, and then we'll be able to, uh, like, yoink with the hook. Yeah. But where are we going to get a rope? Blue glowy. It is a blue glowy. We'll get a rope from somewhere. Uh, we also have stuff in town. I, I know we ha we're offered m a job somewhere. Well, the the guys at the mushroom farm told us. What we about have back to down that talk wall? To the chief. Hmm? You see it on the wall back there? Oh, that thing? No, the white thing onto the right, in the center. You don't see that uh, white strip going down the middle? Yeah. That might just be an I, effect. Okay, I thought it was like. Yeah, I think it's just texture. It looked like a piece of string or something. It kind of does, yeah. Sorry, I have, I've got eyes like a magpie. I look at I, that's. I think that's why hidden object games and stuff are probably the reason why you eyes like playing like them. Eyes like a magpie. Yeah. I mean, it kind of works because you're a crow. Oh, fair enough. Ah. I do no. Well, it's also because I edit video, but that also might help too. Well, the, true. The the I not just it might help me edit videos if I have those eyes. That's for sure. Can I trade something with you? Ah, here we go. Welcome, dear customer. If you're interested in my wares, don't hesitate to just give me a shout. Yeah, we already Tell talked. Tell me about this place. I think we talked to them already. I don't remember. That's right. Let's see. I'm a new face around here. Got a useful info for a newcomer like me? Of course I do. My stall has the best prices in the whole village. And what a coincidence, I'm currently running a newcomer promotion here, so if you buy... I mean Fungilia facts, not your self-advertisement. I've also noticed you no call it Fungilia. It's 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 a common... I think that I do that too with my words. Because I, I say pillow... Or sorry, the way it says pillow, it sounds like I'm saying pell -o, But everyone points that out. It's You're saying Fungilia. I think it's Fungilla? Fungula. Yeah. That would make more sense. But Fungilia know, sounds... Fun and then Gil. Fungilia <laughs> sounds like it would actually be a better name for the village. It would, but there, you're right. There's no I before the A. You're it's absolutely like our right. Brains are, <laughs> it's like our brains just automatically edited a better name in. I'm going to go with Fungilia. All right, cool. It's Fungilia stuck, guys. I did it. <laughs> discount Danosaur. <laughs> <laughs> no. I think this is a discount okay. Lady Danosaur. Daniela. Discount yeah, Danisaur. discount Danielle. <laughs> I don't need your shilling. Ah, fine. Fungilla's a rather special place, you know. That kind of peaceful utopia full of peace-loving creatures and free of the danger of the outside world, or at least it tries to be like that. But really, if you ask me, I'd say the survival of the fittest is the only true way to go. I see. So what are you doing here? Survival of the fittest includes making big bucks, didn't you know? <laughs> uh, and with some good stuff, you can even bribe a Gorgosaurus. Uh, so you buying something or what? Hold on, will you? I'm still looking. Yeah, let's... That's... I don't remember this at all. Fungilly. <laughs> so how about business? Is it going good? Uh, well, it would go better if you spent some money already. What? I said it would go much better if I could restock some of my items. Oh, main gate, huh? Yeah, looks like the village is closed indefinitely. Nobody can get in or out of Fungilia. Back in the day, I used to sell a whole bunch of rare, luxurious, and otherwise unavailable goods, including herbs, spices, fancy beads, and even dyes and pigments. Some of them were as rich as the sp and bright as your skin, kid. Uh, thanks. But now, thanks to that blasted thief, I can't get anything from the outside world and have to rely on scavenging this pitiful place for anything remotely sellable. My shop is just full of nothing but junk. Busted, aren't we? Uh, local items, rare, perfect for wonderful souvenir. 
Sure they are. Man, all the talk about the main gate. Can you oh just use God, a giant crack to get out? Oh. Oh, thank you. Di D Dino Dan here with Dino Dan's Pretty Bad Meteors and Falling Stuff LLC. Yes. Oh, I love it. You out of your mind or what? Can't you see how ridiculously high that is? I ain't risking my life just climbing a steep wall like that. Not to mention I'd have to climb it twice just to return to the village. Hey, relax, lady. I was just asking. Jeez. So you use shells as a local currency. How delightfully odd. In this village? Yeah, folks around here like them a lot. Mostly because they're source, uh, scarce under this mountain. Personally, I really don't care what the currency is as long as it can net me some sweet business deals. Uh, the shells are some of the easier ones to use, though. I used to trade for things in a number of current currencies, including heavy stones, weird statues, and other handicrafts, even some caged mammals. Caged mammals? What on earth are you talking about? That sounds awful. Because it is. For some bizarre reason, some villages use those smelly pests for trade. You can only imagine how unsanitary that was. Ugh. It, I actually can. Why are there two backpacks priced differently? Aside from the color, they look almost the same. Because they are the same. But the second one is a branded True Dun line of sportswear. So I have to pay extra for a little mark and uh, flashiness. Yeah, but you'll be the coolest dinosaur on the block. Thanks for the delightful chat, but I believe I should be on my way now. Uh, yeah, thanks for nothing. Why not buy something next time, huh? Yeah, but I'm not broke because my money all got stolen. I'll buy that shiny rock. Fancy okay. beads restock, yeah. Discount Dinosaur, you got shells? I'll take them. Exactly. <laughs> All right. Dino, yeah. Oh, yeah, Dinoberto. What? Dinoberto. What should we do now? Like, honestly. We got to get a job to get money, but we have to talk to the chief. We had an offer that. somewhere. Well, they told us that we need to go talk to the chief to well, get a job. Let's save our game and then also check the map. And also I need to ask, um, when do you need to uh, vacate? Oh, I can go for, I can go for another hour. Excellent. Okay, because hello, the chief's at the, hello, he's at the resident wall up here. Which we can't get through because. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I can't. Imagine. Unless we spice up his meal, morning Zippy. We don't have anything spicy yet. I just it, since Aaron Miller's, it's like, hey, here's a nickel. Go fuck yourself. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> That's one of my favorite uh, lines from Caddyshack. Here's a dollar twenty-five. So Go fuck yourself. Dino brands. <laughs> yes, Dino brands. Maybe he's Dino got some brand dinosaur toys. Hello there, young miss. You must be the girl from the under cave, correct? Welcome to my humble market stall. How's life? Now I know we've talked to him. I want to see if he's selling anything spicy. Only food stuff? Yes, young miss. I used to sell quite a di lot of different merchandise, but since that Trudon also decided to open a business, I started to harvest oh and God, gather food majesty. items only. Yeah, I remember this. Yeah, okay. Five, yeah, nickel. Something like Fine that. Honorable. No business competition rules. Uh, and didn't have any use for them. That started. Ah. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Of course, young miss. See you soon. We need to get some spicy mushrooms. We need to get some mushrooms that we can put in something and not just... I like that. Okay, hold on a second. Can you go back? Yeah. You see the shells that are currently like in that bowl that she's looking at? We go, we go, we go, yeah, we go Ammonides. Ammonites. Yeah, can you look at those? Yeah, no. The, <gasps> oh, wait. I didn't even realize they're Ammonites. I love Ammonites. Yeah. Look at those Ammonites. Just make you queasy. Wait, what did it say? Squiggle. They're... You hate seafood. Wait, we got an encyclopedia update on that, though. Yeah, ammonites. I actually have some ammonite fossil jewelry. Uh, two pendants and an earring that was made out of one that got split. And here we are in, in the, uh, well, whatever this village, uh, 
fungilia, and they're just right here in a bowl. Fungilla. Let's see. I like that the icon for the croc is literally just it's sleeping. No, 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 that's him. Where is? Would it be? There. Crocs are very sleepy boys. Don't tell me it's an item on this. It yeah. is an item on this. Ammonite. So these are marine mollusks, soft by creatures, including snails, squids, and clams. His ancestors first appeared during the Denovian period. Devonian. In the Pleistocene era. Yeah, de uh, Devonian. De bleh. Devonian. Devonian. I believe, yes. They came in various sizes. Many are small or tiny, but some species reach up to two meters in shell diameter. Ammonites become very abundant in the, Meso in the Mesozoic era. Grip didn't survive past the end of the Mesozoic era, though, but their abundant fossils found across the world become an index fossil. Thanks to them, Homo sapiens will be able to define and identify geological periods. Yeah, they're very useful. They are. And their shells are really cool looking. The fossils are, especially when they opalize. Yeah. Yeah. I like fossils. Honestly, now it's something I'd love to get more of so at some point. We know, that they're, we know that he doesn't like spicy. Yes. And what was it that they put in that was spicy, and where could we get it? That's what's going to go talk to him, see if he could be like, I don't like this specific spicy thing. And be like, oh, hey. And then maybe go to the village healer or somebody. Maybe see if she's got spicy foods. Or spicy something. Something spicy. Get, get. Triceratops, talk to me. Ugh. Halt! No, tri oh, it's you. Again, mess. What, what brings you here? Triceratops. Triceratops, yeah. Hey, Mr. Guard, I've been robbed? Can you help me? Oh, uh, who did this? I, yellow feathered guy. Or was he blue? He looked like an ostrich. Ah, uh, sounds like that thief again. Such a vile creature robbing helpless folks in broad daylight. Now, do you see why we must take all this extra precaution around here? Nevertheless, thank you for sharing that incident with me. I'll make sure to notify the security team about it, ma'am. Looks like I'll be getting my money back anytime soon. So, apparently the chief's apartment's on the top floor of this building, right? You are correct, miss. Oh, cool. So, uh, step aside, please. I'd like to have a word with them. I think you misunderstood me. Our chief specifically stated that to not to let any non-resident enter the residential hall, and since you are not a resident of this district, I'm afraid I can't let you enter, miss. Why? Security regulations. I believe you already know the state of our village is currently under. Darn it. It's all but mayhem because of a single stupid thief. Seriously. So, you're a librarian? No offense, but how could someone so big as you work in a library? <sighs> uh, don't worry. You, you're not the first one to notice that. In reality, our village library consists of a large hall which fits even bigger dinosaurs like me without any problems, and with my horns I can carry scrolls and baskets full of heavy books like it's nothing. So you could say I'm rather natural to fit the job. Uh, I definitely miss it. Aw, guess you don't like your job. I get the funny feeling you don't like your new job that much. Yes, I truly hate it. I dislike screaming at others without good reason, and I really miss my books. But I was assigned to be the guard of this district this week, and I have to support my wife and kids somehow. Oh, right. Family. Have I said something wrong? You seem to be down all of a sudden. It's... I just miss my folks, that's all. I see. You no need to explain it any further. You are an unexpected visitor, after all. I really hope either the gate gets fixed soon, or the t uh, pterosaurs are willing to visit these parts again, so you will be able to at least uh, be able to send them a letter. You don't... <sighs> Thanks, I guess. 
I should go. <laughs> I mean, he's... No, no, that's, he's it's, it's my favorite yeah. Mass Effect line. I should go. Yeah. That's what that's what you say as Commander Shepard. <laughs> Even when it's Fem Shep, it, it still comes out as Mark Mir. I should go. I should go? <laughs> that's <Yeah. hilarious. laughs> well, I Because he says it the best. Go. It's it's like the most common Bioware line in all of Bioware. If you play any of their games, it's I should go. I should get going. I should leave. Likewise, miss. Well, I should go. <laughs> that's great. He's though. a door. He was a librarian. Now he's a door. He was. The Texeratops is a, a door now. Okay, so... All right. We need to get Spicy something to put in his food so he'll leave so we can go talk to the chief. Well, the answer is to buy a shotgun and hunt down the thief yourself. Correct. But we don't have a shotgun or the funds to buy one. I bet you pterosaurs have shotguns. You know, they very well might. We, we could always go see if the... If the pterosaur in the healer's house has a shotgun, no. Oh, she's gone. She hey, wait, 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 wait. Okay, so where does she go? No idea. What's a, what's that actually on sale there that we can actually look at? There's some herbs there. Are they the herbs that the lady needs? Maybe. You might have read about these, but you're not sure. Yeah, let's, they do seem familiar, Mary. If you're not mistaken, they're used in common cold treatment. Okay. Oh, uh, we need. Yeah, see how much she wants these. for them. Can I, can I take, I think I might have seen this plant before. What kind of herb is this? Medical herbs, young miss. Straight from the village farms and must own if you're feeling unwell. Only 10 shells. I'll take it, but I'm out of money. Oh, sorry. You don't seem to have enough shells. I know I don't. I was being hopeful. Look, 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 look. Yeah, I know. <laughs> so cute, just like. I like his little under. I like his little satchel he's got too. Got a little satchel. He's got this pile of steaming herbs. He's got a little wiggly ammonized. This guy just knows what's going on. All right, so we got herbs here that we need to buy for tin shells. Oh, God. We need to do something to get the, unfortunately, make the Texas, Texas ceratops move, so we can get back there to get a job, so we can make money. Yeah, the tech ceratops. I blame you guys. Librarian, security guard, yeah. Oh, let's... Yeah, I mean... Yeah. Oh. I'm just looking. Don't tell me. The window is open, leaving enough space to take a peek inside. I'm just clicking. I have no idea. Okay. Oh. Oh, hello. They're sorting something. Oh, they see us. Uh. He wasn't exactly happy when he noticed you. Well, let's knock on the door and say hello. Oh, never it mind. Won't let me. Oh, let's go look through the other window. Yeah, let's go, let's go peek through the window. I didn't even know that was an option. I, yeah, I'm just being nosy. Oh, look at this. Oh. Eating dinner. Oh. Well, you are blocking the only source of light, so they're like, yeah, we don't want any peeping toms. Get out of here. Oh, look at this hey, poor Swift. guy. He's <laughs> He still hasn't gone to work. He's have yeah, he had like a mental he had like an epiphany. Just like, oh, now I actually have to go back to work. Well hold on, that guy with the cold's oh. still working. Yeah. Because he's being he's probably he he's one of those guys because he Well he's probably one of those guys that's just like I, I d if I don't have a fever of a hundred, I am going to work. Here's a new area. Whoa. I, clicked, I didn't even know we could go I was just trying way. to click on this little edge here. It went down here. Yeah. Dude. Okay. Fungilia, the lake. Lake Fungilia. Totally what it's called. Who lives here? It's relatively well done, considering it's just mud and clay. Prehistoric skooma. Hello. Maybe. Yeah, I clicked him. I was like, yeah, that's me. <laughs> yeah, exactly. As you approach the shack, you can hear some kind of snoring? Somebody must be really tired. Yeah, really tired. Take the campfire. Can I light it? An extinguished campfire most likely belongs to the shack owner. The firewood still is relatively warm. You could probably start it with your torch, maybe? I don't know. How did? Oh, that's right, because we used a rock, and it took her forever. Yeah. Hmm. 
Something Wait. to think about, I guess. Random dino. Hmm, someone at my door. Why are they coming right up to my door? Ohio man in the past running up to door. Yeah, what do you want, huh? Knocks on door. I never saw a dino before. Talk to me, bang door. I got your mail. Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> there okay there's this there's this character that's in the mandalorian who it's like the ladies on like uh moss eisley who yeah. is like fixing the ships we fucking love that character we, me text and go been watching we fucking love that character we call her the cleveland lady we know she's not from cleveland but she acts like every fucking mechanic from cleveland it's like oh yeah you're gonna have to get that fixed you know, it's going to cost you quite a bit just for uh, having me find all these parts that I totally didn't just get from a bunch of Jawas. I'm like, yeah, that's, that is totally her. That's how Cleveland works, man. A lake inside of a hollow mountain? Wow. What's she all about? Pachycephalosaurus. Uh, Pachycephalosaurus. Now, this one I know how to say. Pachycephalosaurus. Uh, Pachycephalosaurus. Ah, what a, what a mouthful. I like it. Will he just hurry up and s sick and tired of waiting here? Uh, waiting for who? The water delivery dude. I was supposed to strap these barrels to his back half an hour ago, and he still hasn't shown up. And these heavies need to go as far as the residential wall, so there's not even a chance I'll be able to carry that far. Ugh, at this rate, I'll just pack my bags and go home. I have nothing better to do with my time. Hey, easy now. He might... He could get here any minute. I'm giving him several more minutes tops, and if I... And off I go. It's not like I wanted to do the water delivery duty today. So you're not the dinosaur responsible for it? No. I'm just an artist. But ever since the village gate got busted, many jobs were reshuffled to focus on the primary needs like guard duties, water delivery, or food hoarding. Take a guess where I landed today. Well, in any case, hope you'll be able to return to your artwork soon. Uh, Soonish. Yeah, thanks. I hope so too. She, yeah, I have to admit, she has, she had a uh, eyeshadow on. She she's she, she is she's definitely got the artist flow going. She knows her she knows her look. She knows her stuff. Pachycephalosaurus. Yeah. Pachycephalosaurus. A thick headed lizard. I don't know why, but this one. This one It's like learning uh deoxyribonucleic acid and, and going yeah. like as a kid, like I could spell that. Like this one I had I actually learned pretty easily because helping Somebody else. I can't even remember, but it's like I could figure that one out. Look, if but you then can you learn, give me like if you can learn to read Latin like that on the fly. This guy. No, oh, I love this one. picture. Look at this. Oh my gosh, look at that. How do we not look at this one? Yeah, it's like, yeah, that's like a husband and wife right there. One hundred percent. She's looking at something real, like a statue. Like, oh, isn't that? They're He's at an like, art museum. Isn't that such a lovely piece, dear? I'm so glad we came to this art museum for our like date night or something. He's just like, yeah, yeah. He's like I could be working. On, to, I could go be. Go I could be working on our now? deck made out of vines. Yeah, I could. Be, I could be working. I could be working on our deck. I like. I like that they got like. <laughs> that's what I assume. He's balding because she's got hair. He doesn't. Feathers. I, that's why I'm like it's like a it's like a, a uh, like a forty something year old couple. Yeah, and she's just like, oh look at this. It's so nice. We never get to go on date night anymore because we're get always to go watching the night. kids or. Or the grandkids, you know, he's just like, man, I really yeah. wanted to go grill something today. <laughs> yeah, I just wanted to grill for Christ's sakes. I love it. I love the art <laughs> in this game so much. <laughs> and I want to well, get some of those sound files to make me on movie trip. Hey, Brian, go for it, man. There. Are... I don't think we can. Go just keep in mind it. that you can't post them on like YouTube because that will get you pinged. Because that website in particular will actually look for like it has bots looking for people using its music so if you're not on its good list like if you don't have an account with it they'll just flag you for it but totally if you want to make trailers and you don't care they're not going to take your video down they'll just put a flag on it saying like hey our music he's talking about that podcast we released yesterday hmm. i'll I need to listen to that yeah Because guys, if you haven't heard, podcast. You know is what? Good. 
I don't know why they decided to draw the rear, uh, like, facing the... Like, they could have just made it corners like this. But if you look at the rear, it's just like... You could see the eyes are just the same yeah. on the back. It's... I have noticed... It's very Rocco's Modern Life, which I am it all for. It is very Rocco's Modern I, Life. It's like one of my favorite shows on Nickelodeon back in the day. Really? It I wasn't was. a huge fan of Rocco's Modern Life. I was more of a I have a lot fan. of, like, I think one of my favorite quotes is when Heifer went to Heck to visit his grandmother. He's like, Grandma, what are you doing here? I like it here. It's warm. And I was like, yeah, that's that sounds a lot <laughs> like my grandmother. Yes. <laughs> I, I liked, um... I liked Hey Arnold. Yeah. Better. I don't know why, but I still remember the whole... Uh, there was an episode where at the boarding house, there was the um, the guy who was from the Eastern... The former Soviet Union Eastern Bloc. Yeah. That lived in the boarding house. He could not read English. And there was an entire episode teaching him how to read. And he, he learned how to read enough to get himself uh, back to the boarding house. No. When he was lost in New York, and it was really wholesome. I don't well, know why I remember that. I want to check out the lake. Go for it. I'm a, I, oh, I didn't it. even see the fishing pole. Oh, I saw it. I was like, I'll... I thought that was just part of the shack. Yo, what are you doing there? <laughs> Wait, could I borrow that for a minute? Uh, but it's not mine. Uh, oh, whatever. Just be quick about it and don't break anything. Oh, and return it back when you're finished. Thanks, Pachycephalosaurus. Yeah. Okay, fishing rod. Let's use it. <gasps> wait! Wait! Oh, yeah, you can't just take it with you. Oh. I think it's because we're going to make our own kind of thing, but we're going to need to borrow it for here for reasons? Well, let's, let's go fish then. Yeah, we'll just try... Let's see how this works. I guess? I'm not entirely sure. Maybe. If this game is a fishing mini game, it wins all of the points. Here's the thing. My score is on video games. If you go to my Steam, if you know where my Steam is, all of my reviews will be the exact same. Because if I like a game, it gets a thumbs up. You don't need my description for it. It's good. But if you have fishing game, immediately thumbs up. If there's a fishing mini game, I'm there. I need to drop something. Okay. I dropped the torch for a second. Yeah. Oh, and uh, Kaiju says, hi, Mecca. Kaiju? How are you, my dude? Oh, click on the sponsor. Immediately, this game went up 15 points. There's a fishing mini game. Oh, look at this. Oh, Action pose. Fishing rod. Yeah. Huh. Well... That's not very exciting, is it? It's fishing. It's fishing. Some people like fishing. How can anyone like this? I'm getting bored to death here. No, Niff, you just haven't really found... There, <gasps> there you go. Uh-huh. Yes. Seriously? So you have no, you have no <laughs> need for a wet, slimy water weed, so you just toss it aside. I guess you have to fish again, but this time you have to look for the right spot to fish in. There were two other spots. We're going to try them. All right. Click on it and throw it out it. further. Further. There. Go for it. Yeah, action and pose. Uh, I love the action pose. Yes. Just going to say it's boring. Yeah. Because, well, another thing, too, is like you got to go where the fish are. I know. Nothing. Ah, oh, nothing. What a waste of time. No, it's, it's not a waste of time. There's one is, more spot. Fishing is really a huge, huge thing in the world for a reason. Mm-hmm. Food. I've never been huge into fishing. We used to do it when I was a kid. Yeah, I, I used to do it a lot when I was a kid and a, a teen and a young adult. Actually, I did a lot of fishing. But then I stopped somewhere like in my mid-20s because I just wasn't really like, I didn't have anybody to go with. I never went fishing. Like, well, teenager I, is kind of when I stopped. I, I should say, I didn't have anybody to go with who were, like, just casual. I don't want to, I don't really care fishers. Everyone else is, like, yeah. super hardcore into it. Mm -hmm. Like, they're, okay, it's like, like, there's no in between. It's like, you're either, like, I don't really care or you're uh, there to make fun. No, we got, there's plenty of more spots to fish in. 
Well, I think those are the only three. We'll try again. We'll try one more. Well, wait. We have a rod. We can always put something on it. I don't think we have anything. Yes, I know. We could try putting oh, a mushroom on there. Let's try. Yeah, let's try. Let's try. The bowl of worms. Um, Those were... Those were... You know what? That might actually work. Yeah, hold on. We're going to put this fishing rod back real quick and go get some worms. Well, they weren't that worms. It was the... No, no, there were there were worms in the pantry. Oh, worms, yeah, yeah. worms, yes. Yeah, worms. North. No, uh, yes, war north, because that's where the. I believe it was north. I might be mistaken. Actually, no, I'm not. I believe it is north. Road to field. No, no, yes. I can't live in this village. No, it's not north. You're mistaken. That's okay. We have to leave this village. I've lost my way. Oh, one hundred percent. But yeah, no, my dad, when I was. Uh, same, Brian, same. Yeah. When I was a kid, my dad would uh, fly fishing, would do fly fishing. He would make his own flies. Yeah. No, I just, cool. I, I just use a basic sinker hook and a. Uh, that's it. There. It's this I, way. I don't have like a floater or anything. I just keep my finger on the line. If I feel something on it, I'll know if it's a fish. And I'll know if they've got it. But that's just me. Oh, there's a bag hanging there. I'm sure that's not important. I didn't even notice that before. Well, hello. Hmm. Check the... No, no. Because if it's green, it means it's a walk icon. If it's orange, yeah. it means you click on it. Go, 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 go. Yuck. No way. Besides, why would you want to... What would you do with it anyway? Ammo for some weapon, perhaps? You could say that. So apparently you can't get those. <laughs> can you take any other Darn food? It. Wait, wait. Can you take any other food? Various goods... I think we try it. And it so many like, things to eat, yet there seems to be no trace of your favorite fruits. Shame. Hmm. We already have a mushroom. Mu well, take and another. Like More mushrooms. There. No, it wouldn't let me when I tried before. It's like, you already have a mushroom. Don't be greedy now. Yeah, food just enables her pebble find -o vision I know. Oh, man, this issue is totally awesome. I seems like it's really familiar, like I'm living this or something. Probably should eat this just so I don't. What do you think the Zoro Force would do, Mecca, in this situation? Uh, they would f probably find a way to legally be an E into the evil person's lair, who's totally the chief, and uh, stop them. I think you're right. We should do what the Zoro Force does. Yeah, I don't. I think we're gonna have a harder time getting past that Triceratops librarian than the Zoro Force would, because though he may be a genteel librarian at heart, he is still. A, like, two-ton dinosaur. <laughs> a little bit. Just a little bit. Whoa, whoa, what the... Eh. What? Uh, the iPad problems. Okay. So, what should we do now? Well, hold on. Okay. Mm, oh. I'm just <sighs> clicking on stuff. Go for it. Yes. Do you need anything? Oh, that's your door. Go oh, that's right. She did okay. say that in the last stream. Okay. Mm. Murder. We do. Mm -hmm. Need to get into the apothecary at some point. Need to Hammer. Why is there a hammer there? I thought this was like a resale store. But no, he's the one we need the cold medicine for. Right, but we don't have the cold medicine. Yeah. We don't have it. I know, but. Yeah, go, go, Power Rangers. Yeah, Striker picked it up. Yeah, exactly. I was playing the riff on the keyword, but I didn't set it up on Discord for you. Oh, okay, I, was I didn't hear it. <laughs> No, I have a way that it's, I have a way that might make it easier for you to hear it next time. I just have to set it up. What should we do? Keep going. There's more to do. I know, but where to? Where to? Well, let's take a look. Take a look at the map. Go to a new area. Okay. Hell yeah, I did. So this just leads here. Let's see. But also the the one dinosaur lady we were talking to, I have no idea where she is now. 
She's vanished. What was her name? Tra, I think. Tra, yeah. Yeah. Don't know where she is. Uh, she's somewhere. Um, she's somewhere. May maybe check. I don't think we've been back to like the main like reading area since she left. So let's go there. Yeah. Maybe she's there. Maybe. It's a very distinct possibility, but I have no idea. No, Ew. just a, just a very upset pouty Stegosaurus. Well, I'm sorry, Stegosaurus. You're like, oh yeah, isn't that the issue where the spoiler gets dropped? This guy, we can't go over here. Look at that up there. Hold on. Hmm? Oh, I just saw that. Yeah. I think I did that last stream as well. Big bowl. Yeah, please don't do anything a food bowl. Oh, yeah. So he doesn't like hot, hot sauce. Yeah, we don't have hot sauce. But maybe uh, what's her name can make make some. I and know, I but first we need to get the herbs to do the cold remedy to give to the other guy to get something from. Uh, let me see what we got in your inventory here. All right, you dropped your okay. torch in the other area. It's Yeah, it's in over by the lake. Hmm. Let's try going down to the lake. Yeah. To the lake. Let's talk to this person. Oh, this guy. Yeah, what was he doing? He was... Erdromius, please. What are you doing? Oh, I'm just waiting for my friend, silly. What else would I be doing at such a late hour, hmm? Uh, how exactly, Wayne? By pacing back and forth? You don't understand. We get to explore the forest behind the village today. I just can't contain my excitement. Oh. The village... Be forest er behind the village. Maybe it's off by the lake? Maybe. Nah, I don't think so. Oh, you didn't get that torch, though. Hell yeah, we do. Ah! Oh, oh. sorry. <laughs> we were trying to do it at the same time, weren't we? Mm hmm. There we go! Got it! <laughs> Let's light that torch. Let's light that campfire. Yeah. Oh, that's a good idea. Never mind. No need try, to light Try it. using it on the campfire anyway. Don't you feel this firewood is a little bit burnt out? Mm. You can't ignite it anymore. Well, okay. can you take okay. it with you? No. What's in the barrels again? Like, stuff for the residential wall. Oh. Just supplies. We can't take them. Hmm. There's a perfectly good staircase right back there in the background. Why can't we go there? It, it's because we can. It's just this way and up. Yeah, fair point. Hmm. Forest behind... Is it past this way? Uh. Yeah, they master the other cultivation. Maybe. Can we take them? <gasps> oh, there she is! Yeah. Look, that's Tra. Let's go have a chat. A long sleep makes a good net to catch a chicken. Um, actually, my mom told me that. I've never tried it before. Me neither. Never dealt with chickens much. Hey, Snew. How are you? Hope you <laughs> haven't had any more encounters with the little thief. No, I didn't. I'm all good. But I really... I really use any kind of money right now. That's great to hear. And don't worry, as I said, I found a little job to do. Should be a perfect task for you. Now... Tell me, how would you like to help us with our little mammal problem? I hate those little critters. So I could mind filling me in, boss. There's a nest of small mammals on the outskirts of the farm, and I'd like you to take care of them since they're a complete menace to our food supplies. They grew in numbers recently, so we can't afford any risks. Wait a minute, my dude. 
<laughs> my dude. Hold on a minute, my dude. Take care of them? What? What do you want me to do to them? Easy there, Sniff. I'd just like you to see you destroy their nest and not capture any mammal you might encounter. Okay. Oof, oof. I was getting kind of worried there for a minute. I can tell by your face. So I shall show you the way to the forest, or do you still have any unfinished business? We've got nothing else to go. Let's lead the way. I'm ready for some action, because we are stuck till this moment. All right. That's the spirit. Now then. There's one last thing you before you head out. Wait, wait, what's that? Don't tell me. Indeed it is. I can't let you do the work in the forest with a small leaf bag like that. Here, take it. A shiny brand new large backpack? Whoa, I love it! Thanks a whole lot! I made it myself, so I'm really glad you like it. And don't worry about your old items. I shall keep them safe with me while you're busy with the mammals. Now then. Shall I glide you, uh, guide you to the glade? So we can't keep the backpack? I or guess do we have to put the stuff in it's, the backpack? It's, I think it's just for this area, maybe. Maybe. There's a cardboard box. You arrived at the village outskirts. A green scenery of many trees and plants greet you here. You you, but you have a mammal problem to deal with here. No time to uh, for admiring the scenery. There's a box. There's another box. Oh, let's get just just sorting berries. Yeah. Yeah. Do you need anything? <laughs> he looks. So, I love that face. That was so good. Uh, hi. I was sound here to take care of. All right. Say no more. We presume the mammal nest is just up ahead as they're gathering a large number of glade next to us. While we were able to capture some of those mammals, nobody's even able to find the nest yet. We will surely be more than glad if you could do something about that furry menace as this year's food supplies are in grave danger considering the mammals recently grew in numbers considerably. All right, I'll see what I can do about the little furry problem of yours. Sure thing. You could freely use whatever stuff you can find around here to aid you. All right. While you have no intention of borrowing the sack, you notice there's a nice piece of thread here. Yo, mind if I borrow this thread for a while? Uh, yeah, sure, go ahead. Why do I get the feeling? We got thread. We got a hook. It's not in our pack. Hopefully we'll keep it. We, we will, well, don't worry, we will save. Fortunately, this game does have a pretty good autosave. It does have a really good autosave. Uh, what it's on the ginkgo seeds. Oh, I was just about to ask what that was. Acquired ginkgo seeds. Ugh, it's true what they say. They really do smell horrible. You could take a look at it in the encyclopedia to find out what they are. Yeah. Because ginkgo trees are a tree that still exists, but it's probably not the exact same variety. Suspicious spot, huh? Suspicious spots. You can s clearly see several footprints of a tiny animal. Something small was here recently. Mm. Over there, too. We're looking at animal sign. Those half-eaten ginkgo seeds are uh, of no use for you. So use the ginkgo seeds. Although it looks like this place was visited by a small creature, you might want to set up a trap here. Ooh, yes, indeed. And there's a stick over here. Ah, we yes. need to go get... Oh my god, we're going to go for one of the most classic traps of all time. We need that empty box. What's behind those bushes that are standing out from the background there? Hold on. First, I know where oh, the never box mind. is. They're, they're probably all the same. Yeah. We will check out at them. But if I remember... Yes. Wooden box. You take. Hmm. It would be a pain to carry around. Okay, well then just does it anyway. Sticks it in book bag. No problemo. Wait, no. There we go. Zenith will uh, produce a sawed off of a shotgun and keep one of those mammals, for example. Yeah. 
Of course. Z Zniff's not as if Zniff's not afraid of a little uh, a little shotgun axe, and she's she's seen quite a bit since her beginning of uh, her adventures. The box with a lone thread doesn't make it for the best of traps. There's something missing here. Yeah, well, obviously. And then I think you also put the seeds in there too. I remember seeing such a box trap in a comic book once, but it requires a small line and bait as well. So why don't you set the seeds down? Yeah. Oh! Look at that, it's little head bopped out. Oh, it's so cute. Now you should think about setting a trap out. Well, this isn't very efficient. Yeah, well, of course, we haven't finished it. Now we need string. Now you just have to hide somewhere. All right. Can I hide behind the geeko tree? Probably, since it seems like the only spot able to do so. There we go. Yes. Whoop. Wait. <laughs> Oh, that's so cute. Look at him, little shrew. Huh, looks like you don't have, uh, don't look like Ginkgo Seeds, uh, doesn't like Ginkgo Seeds that much. Me, can't really blame them, though. We need something else. Mm. Well, read the manual on what they do, what they do like. Let's see. I love this guy. Yeah, just look at that, like, sassy attitude right there. It varies among species. So, could be anything. Well, I want to see... Uh... Granary, uh... No. Don't know. Hmm... Can we go up here? We'll take a look. <laughs> An old overgrown with vegetation uh, and hollowed stump is sitting on a st uh, stone shelf over there. You wonder if there's a way to see what's inside it, if you had something to stand on. Unfortunately, I don't have anything to stand on. It looks like this is the only area we've got to go to. No, you have something to stand on. Well, we have a... Ah, we do! You just have to take the box apart. Your trap doesn't work. True. But I can put it back, I think. Or do I have to, uh... Wait. Yeah. You decided to mantle the trap for now and collect all those parts. Yeah. Because nice. we need to get better bait. Or kind of... Yeah. And thinks of a better plan. Okay. Well. We need better bait. Can I stand on it? No. Yeah, just click that up there and then the eyes. Maybe you should put the box on there just to see. Just to pick it up. Mm. True. Yeah. Uh, let's hope you're strong enough to support your weight. Yeah, I agree. Here's nothing. Oh, it does. Aha! Oh, wait. Oh, I think we found a nest. Bingo. Bingo. Nice. How should I get rid of the... Hmm. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it looks like you're the only one to truly despise ginkgo seeds. Okay. Oh yeah, Pelagian, we'll go check with the berry guy in a second. Well, we can't what take we... items with us. No, the berry guy right, right outside, because he's oh, also picking that's berries. that's true. Hmm. Alright, well, let's go back down there. Yeah. Wait, 
There we go. Fire, maybe. We don't have our items. We don't have our torch. We need to figure out something to do with the... Um... I think we need to figure out something to do with the... Uh... The nest before we trap them. Yeah. Breadfruit. Yeah, breadfruit. Okay. What about the other fruit? Can we take the other fruit just to be juniper berries? Ah, oh, juniper berries. They smell so good. They are tasty in some aspects. This one look this looks like it's out of place, but it's not. Alright, well activate her pebble senses. How do we do oh crap, how do we do that? Middle it's one, I think. And then you click her face. Your pebble sense is tingling, and apparently there's only one last pebble left to find in this location. Okay. So there is a pebble here. It just looks like it should have something, but uh, it's not. That's how they that's how they hide things. It works well. I know it's okay. clever. Let's let's go back and see if we can uh lure out that one and capture it now. You know, I bet I can actually do it under the where the box is, maybe? No, that's, too, that's not where the suspicious spot is. Yeah, I was going to say, right, you could capture one now. I don't know what you'd do with it. Uh, put it in my bag. Yeah. Like, I, I do all things. Of course. That's a uh, breadberry? Breadfruit. Breadfruit, okay. Put a breadfruit here. Oh, he's interested. Oh, wait, nope. Run. Wrong thing. Eh. Mix junior bears with a bathtub to make gin. Yes. Listen, that may or may not be what I was implying, but yes. Now let's see if they'll go for the breadfruit. Hide. Eat breadfruit. I've never had breadfruit. I just know it exists. Come. Eat fruit. Consume. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> now. Oh, it just squeaked. The mammal easily fell for the trap. That's one guy off the list. I should notify the Uniceratops about the mammal. Oh, let's go tell the guy. Come get it, and then I can get the box back. Yeah. Oh, you know what? There's probably some in every one of those bushes. So you probably have to grab fruit, uh, different fruit for each one. Mm, That's probably what go the, to the other suspicious spot. Yep. Since there's two suspicious spots. And probably grab another breadfruit while you're here. Are hey, you in charge around here when it comes to those little furry mammals? Uh, yes, I am. You need anything? Yeah, just managed to capture one of the little fellows. Figured you might want to know. Oh, you did? Excellent. I'll take care of it right away. Alright, easy now. <laughs> <Grab it>. oh. <laughs> that look of like fuck. All right, I got it. I'll take this little crater here from here on out. Thanks for your help. You can report a job well done. Uh, to try, but you can take here, stay here, and look for some more of these little mammals if you still wish to help us. We still haven't found their nest. So I think if you solve all of it... Want to bet? If I can't spoil this prize now, I need to find a way to deal with the nest first. Well, we could take it. Now... No, wait. <laughs> no, there. Take. Try the other suspicious spot. Oh, I'm going to. We're going to put some delicious, delicious... There's one on the right, too. Is there one on the right? Mm -hmm. Right by the tree. Oh. Yeah, let's try that one first and we'll go get some more food. Put some berries. Yeah. There he is. Look at that little possum critter. All right, now you just got to hide from it and do it again, I guess. Yeah. Play Jane, you're giving me good ideas, man. 
don't know if it'll work though. We'll try it. Come, little friend. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. No. <laughs> Just yes. Alright, let's go get the Unis Inesca Ceratops. You're gonna get paid a lot for this one. Oh man, I hope so. You need them you need these clams. If your water skin right there, could I borrow that for a minute? That's uh, my private water skin, so I'm uh, not so sure about that. Why do you need it? I believe it'll really come in handy during my extraordinary mammal hunt. Well, uh, you promise you won't damage it or uh, drink from it? It's one of my prized possessions, you know. Yeah, sure. Extra careful with the water skin. No drinks. Got it, boss. Promise to return in one piece. Okay, there you go. But first, could you bring me some water? I'm very thirsty, and I haven't yet to finish my task. Yeah, let's let's go get him some water. After we quickly grab a breadfruit. Yes. And then we still gotta tell him about the. Uh... I didn't know we could take his water skin. That's pretty useful. Yeah, Pelagian had a good idea about the water skin. Fill it with water and then use it on the the nest. Because mammals can't swim, but um, it may freak them out. It may get them to leave. Yeah, you filled it with water. Now it's really heavy. Yeah, water's heavy. I like. There's like a. I like. There's an action shot of her just getting water. They have so many good action shots. Yeah. Now you got to get water for yourself. But really, try not to damage it, okay? Yeah, now now you gotta do it again, I guess. Okay, that's fine. But hey, also, there's another one. Hey, is it neat reporting another mammal successfully caught? Oh boy, there's nothing stopping you. Let's go. Yeah. Now let's take a look at this varmint here. Take a look under there. Oh, this oh. one's a little bit ornery, isn't it? <laughs> ah, I'll take it from here on out. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Do weird mammal hissing sound. Cat just goes, what? <laughs> yeah. Excellent. You managed to capture another one. You're doing good and good. I'll tell Trial to throw you some bonus your daily payment. Oh, yeah. Their nest is still around and nowhere to be found. But, but it's a surprise. I gotta figure out a way to fix it. And I will, after I go get more water. And deal with that last suspicious spot. Indeed. Maybe that's the spot that actually likes those berries. That would make sense, right? Well, Maybe. If, if you, after we... Yeah. We'll, we'll also get some juniper berries, too. Oh, yeah. We'll grab some juniper berries and maybe get some more ginkgos. Uh, seeds too to see if that actually is useful for anybody. Grab some of those just in case. How about you grab the box? You turn around and he just snaps her next. Oh, God. Listen, what we don't see does not concern us at that matter, I suppose. We'll try these first, just because I am curious. Nope. Somebody came out. I don't and think they like... They don't work. They may not work. Who knows? Or maybe this might be the one, might be the one that has like an acquired taste. Exactly. And, you know, if they don't work, we've got options. That's a really long piece of rope. That is a really long piece of rope. Way longer than we thought wow. it was. Honestly, yeah. That that was a thick, long thread. Hold on. She's got to do this first so she can do the... Yeah. Ha! They may not go for it. 
Nope. Nah, that's okay. Well, we have ginkgo seeds, so if we ever need to use them for any reason, we can now. This is true. Of course, if we if we use the water... If we use the water on that a hive, and then we just... I guess use ginkgo seeds after... I don't know. Maybe, maybe We'll see what happens now. We're going to flood them out. We are. We're going to do it. It's just so cute. I know. Little, little mouse-sized possum-looking little buddies. Our ancestors. Weird little possum shroom things. Yes, I bet he domesticates them and makes them into his furry marching armory, uh, army for the world domination. Indeed. You know, that does sound like a very super villain thing to do, so I wouldn't be surprised if somebody did it. Yeah, neither would I. Oh, no. Dude. <laughs> oh my gosh, leap. Got it. And now. Aha! Now we just gotta go get the uh the get the guard guy now. Yep. We gotta go to the UNESCO Ceratops. Yeah. I don't remember if it's actually pronounced UNESCO Ceratops, but that's just what I'm calling him, man. Put the stinky seeds in the librarian salad. Oh, if they let us keep it, that could work. Now let's go for the home team. Three mammals captured. Wow, really? Three captured in just one day? You really are the first, uh, on your very first work shift? You're a natural. Yeah. I have a little brother, so, you know. All right, easy now. All right, what's the person on this one? We had, like, a sh we had grumpy, angry, Oh, oh. This, this one's swearing at me. Oh my god, what I don't are you, think I've ever saying? heard these words before. Wow, you learned that in Dinosaur? I'm impressed almost. Alright, you got it from here, bub. Alright, three of them in your first work day, huh? This is great. You sure helped me out a lot today. Now if I only locate their nest. Yes, yes, yes. Come to me, box. No, wrong button. Box. Now we just uh, go back up there, I guess. Yeah. We're going to try this grand plan of pouring water on their nest. I think that might work. I think it will. Yeah, Nif is a apex predator. I agree. Oh, yeah. Nif 100% is. Oh, uh, yes. Use the skin on the barrow. Let's see how it works. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Definitely from New Jersey. Uh. There we go. I'm glad she sticks her tongue out when concentrating on things like most people do. Yeah. Oh, look at that. That one was Look at that huge. big chunk. That's all, all folks. Oh, how the mighty have fallen. The bro is taken care of now. Let's take it. <laughs> we just got it. All right, you're supposed to deliver to capture mammals, so here goes. It's so heavy. Oh, <laughs> right. Hopefully it won't do any mayhem in your backpack. Take a look at your backpack. <laughs> you look at it! <laughs> <laughs> just face down, butt in the air. Oh, my lord. That Can you take just... a closer look at it? No, unfortunately. Let's see. Look at him. Fortunately, it's still unconscious. In other words, it won't cause much trouble in your backpack for now. Yeah, let's get out of here before it does. Yeah, just look at. Let's go. We gotta go give them to the Nineska Ceratops. Listen, the water skin wasn't used for anything horrible. Just to hold water and to be poured out of it. Bead! Yeah. So I brought this for you. <laughs> looky, looky what I got here. Is that a... Wow. Don't tell me you managed to capture three mammals and destroy their nest. Well, yeah, I kind of did. And this is beyond excellent. You sure did help us a whole lot today. With workers like you, we might be able to complete, get rid of these mammals from our pastures by the end of the year. Right, too bad. It's not my dream job. 
I'll tell Trawl to throw a bit of a bonus for your today's payment. Really? Hey, thanks. No, thank you for getting all your hard work through, and uh, I'm expecting more great things from you in the future. Let's give him back his water skin as well. Yeah. Because we're, we're going to do an experiment with everything else in the backpack, which is keep it in there. Huh. Thought you needed that water skin. Okay, guess not. All right, well, hopefully we'll return it when we leave. There is a pebble in this area somewhere, but I guess we I don't... I know. I don't know where it is, though. Ah, well. It's... I'll find it one day. It's fine. Oh, you gotta talk to... Yeah, I think you have to oh, talk to... Oh, right. okay. Oops. Yeah. Gotta do a wrap-up. Oh. <laughs> I actually clicked on the sack of fruit. <laughs> Hello again. Thank you for your stellar work with those mammals and the nest. Okay. I guess I'll be going now. Here's all the things I borrowed. I might have left some of your stuff on the ground during my mammal hunt. All right. Thanks again for your hard work. You might want to go and try to talk, to try to collect your daily payment. I suppose you know how to get back to the village. It's okay. I remember. I guess I should get going now. Okay. Seeing you. To draw to get money. Oh, I love that loading so screen. That's so cute. Greetings, new. Oh my god, look at your achievement! Yeah. <laughs> that was some excellent Mammals work. Mammals tremble before her. <laughs> yes. Mammals tremble before her might. Excellent work back in the forest. Here you are, your hardware and shells for today. And as promised, here are all your items back. <laughs> What's it say? Employee of the month was the achievement. Really nice. <laughs> no worries. Whoa, wait, wait a minute. How did you... Stefan told me all about it. Who? Stefan the Unoceratops. I believe you've already met him. He was sitting next to the chief during the meeting. Ah, uh, the small annoying sidekick. Anyway, you're free to go for now, although if you'd like to help some more, be sure to give me a shout. And there's still lots of work on the do in the fields around us. Great, got it. Ah, not to mention my father would like to have a word with you. I wonder what's up. But more importantly, what's up with that horrible smell? Oh, I'm just preparing some fertilizer for our plants. Sorry about the mess that would be uh, that, that horrible smell. Please be careful not to step on anything, as the smell may linger on your skin for days. That's gonna be sick. So where's your father? Now. He should be at home in the building right next to me. Okay, thanks. I guess I'm gonna go see the old man then. You got Whoa. 140 shells. We got paid. We got paid. Holy smokes. All right. We have made enough money to do a lot. We have. Or maybe just enough. Though I must say, I feel like this is just a good... A good stopping point. A good stopping point. We, we took care of the mammal menace, guys. Yeah, we did. And we carried... A, the tiniest of chunkers in our book bag to a dinosaur. <laughs> yeah, the mammals really haven't changed in their round shape, that's for sure. They really haven't. But this was the tiniest of chunkers. You saw him. He's so cute. Yeah, rich dino girls now. Hell yeah. So oh, she, yeah. So she just took a dump in the garden? Yeah, well, I mean, we're, I, we're not going to we're not gonna question her, her listen, ways. Listen, don't listen. I'm going to come up here to the camera just to tell you. Guys, fertilizer is made from excrement, and it is okay. Yes. Well, some natural fertilizers. So it's okay. Yeah. It's natural. And we're going back. <laughs> I don't know why I felt the need to move her closer to the screen for that, but I did. It's true. Looks at the fading hands. Oh, yeah. Ah, are your hands fading? No, oh, oh, do I have fading hands? I don't know. Thunder, uh, Thunderclap Sasquatch said, looks at fading hand. <laughs> well, it could be that Thunderclap might be uh, also experiencing uh, a, 
a certain level of uh, of transcendence uh, in the mental part of their brain. That's uh, true. Yeah. Are you becoming transcendent? Are you becoming transcendent? <laughs> yeah, well, that's shitty. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, no, you don't put it in the pants. They are friend shaped. You mix it into the dirt. They are friend shaped unless you hold them like that dinosaur was. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm they are. Oh no, because Thunderclap went back in time. I got it. It was a f joke about him. Oh, Back okay, to the Future. Okay. Wow, I mixed my head. Okay, anyway. I, anyway. A movie I've never seen. Uh, just drop trowel and drop a dude. Yeah, exactly. Dinosaurs oh are perfect. God, what is this? Look, if I pull, look, <laughs> that you, is not look, you. <laughs> that's not how it works. Gotta Clearly, be, that's not how it works. You don't. You just don't go pooping in people's fields. You don't no. doesn't really fertilize much. You want to use animal? Listen, yeah. all right. As someone who grew up with on a farm, we did use cow manure for fertilizer. But what you do is you take it and you mix it in with the dirt. You don't just yeah. There's a there's a process. Drop trowel right above the lettuce. There is a process. <laughs> but oh, uh, man, that was cool. Uh, we'll be back again. Uh, on. Maybe Wednesday. I might not be able to because I might be uh, dealing. I'm, I have a dental surgery tomorrow, like a legit, like I'm going to be knocked out and possibly have stuff in my mouth for a while. Oh, boy. So depending on that, I might not be able to stream tomorrow because I might just be like, oh, cotton, all that stuff in my mouth. Um, so that'll be tomorrow. And then uh, Thursday, I have another dental appointment. Uh, but yeah, Wednesday I probably it'll just be a wait and see thing. Um, if everything's yeah. good by Friday, I still I'll just keep you guys posted if I'm able to actually stream anything. If not, I'll just have Narracer uh, come on and someone else narrate. I'll just sit here and do hand si signals. That's, that sounds like fun <laughs> just anyway. Do, just do hand signals in Narracer. <laughs> That's the end of the stream. We'll be back again on. Uh, Whenever my mouth isn't full of blood and cotton, as a cotton tomorrow. balls and numbing agents. Exactly. Oh, yeah. All right. TMI. You guys have a good night. Good night, everybody. And see you on the next courtesy flush. Oh yeah, take us mm -hmm. out, sexy saxophone music. I just started playing oh. the keyboard just out of nowhere. Oh, that's fine. Oh, that saxophone though. Have a good night, everybody. Good night.